The Achilles tendon is the, the largest and the strongest tendon in the human body. And when jumping or doing activities like in basketball or tennis, um, it can, it's, ex it's exposed to up to 10 times your body weight of force on that tendon as you're jumping or landing. And, um, and again, it is, it, it's what allows someone to participate in sports like basketball and tennis and soccer because it helps you jump and push off and run and, and be active. There's essentially two different types of treatment. There's surgery or surgical repair, um, of which there's a couple different kinds. And then there's conservative care or non-surgical, which um, the non-surgical care is a very, very reasonable option to do in certain individuals. There's certain pros and cons to treating someone without surgery. Uh, there's no risk of, of surgery and infection. Um, there's a slightly higher risk that a, the tendon can tear again. Uh, you may also have a little more weakness when you're pushing off because it doesn't heal quite as strong. Um, with repairing it, uh, you take the two ends of the tendon and it's an incision on the back part of your, of your ankle and you take the two ends and you reattach them directly. The biggest advantage is to having surgery to repair Achilles tendon is uh, usually you wind up with an increased, almost normal strength um, when you're of the calf muscle when you're pushing off. If you don't do surgery, it's always going to be a little weaker because the two ends of the tendon are separated and, and the, your calf muscle can't generate much pressure because your Achilles tendon is effectively lengthened and it can't, the physics of it, you can't generate the pressure on the heel to push off. Um, uh, the other advantage, major advantage to Achilles tendon repair is a lower incidence of, of it tearing again. Um, significant higher risk of, of, a, of a repeat Achilles tendon injury if you treat it without surgery. Um, it's, not it's, it's not dramatically higher, but it's enough that for someone who's active and trying to get back to activities, um, it's, it's, it's a better chance that they're not going to injure it again if you do surgery. The advice that um, I offer a patient who has an Achilles tendon rupture is know your expectations of what you want to get back to doing. Um, if, if you're more of a sedentary lifestyle, this happened because you just missed a step and you're not active in sports, uh, the, the conservative treatment, a very reasonable option for you. Uh, lower risk of, of infection or complications from anesthesia um, and you will get back to doing most of your daily life without surgery. Um, if you're someone who wants to get back to heavier activities, sports, um, your job involves a lot of lifting, a lot of carrying, a lot of ladders and stairs, um, you may entertain or, or really consider surgical reconstruction where you actually have to have it repaired to get you, give you a better chance to get back to your previous level of activity.